Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the objectives to do today. Uh, they released yesterday, could have totally have done it yesterday, but as you guys know, I'm not a huge fan of playing this game in general, but since they didn't release anything for content today, I decided to just do the objectives today. So this is obviously not the full team that I am going to be using in these highlights that you guys will be seeing, but I just wanted to show you guys some new 4321 instructions that I've been using. And these are instructions that are actually from uh, Air Japes. Am I positioning these players properly? I actually am, yeah, wow. Um, it's uh, it's tactics and instructions from Air Japes. He sent me these back in January. He said that he was gonna do a guide for it. And I don't know if it ever actually came out, but I do have a lot of fun using it. The only real problem that I have with uh, the 4321 is how vulnerable you are in the midfield areas, even if you have a very good balance in regards to the midfielders that you have. Um, because of the fact that, you know, this game is very, like, counter-attack heavy, very defensive heavy. So, if you play like this, you kind of are putting yourself at a disadvantage. But you could also score more opportunities because of the way that the team actually attacks. So, you can see that it's on pressure on heavy touch 5 and 6. Balance with crazy width, literally maximized. And players in the box is set to a solid 7. Uh, instructions for this team is stay back while attacking for the fullback. Stay back while attacking cover center for... Uh, the center mid. The Renato Sanchez and Bruno Fernandes, the center mids, I have them on cover center. You can choose to choose between either one, but as you guys know, people mostly attack through the middle anyway, so it's not necessarily a big deal. Uh, for the top, we have Drift Wide getting behind for the guys on the sides, and then we have False Nine for the center forward. Now, for me, in regards to using this team, I like using it like this because I have sentimental value towards literally every single player maybe not Diego Carlos because wasn't really completely familiar with Diego Carlos when he was an FC Porto player at the time but regardless he still was a player Oblak used to bother the hell out of me because of how good he was at Benfica um, and obviously probably the best goalkeeper in the world right now top three if anything um, and it's just a really cool team so I wanted to use this team because it's more for sentimental value I will say generally speaking, that I don't think Quaresma is that great to use because of the fact that he is a high-low work rate player with 80 stamina, right? But I still enjoy using him because it's an incredibly usable version of himself, right? Uh, I think his off-the-ball move is actually very solid. It's just that certain situations in the game, his stamina just get, it gets really low, right? But um, regardless, you guys are going to go ahead and see some highlights for the 4-3-2-1. After the highlights, at the end of the video, you guys can go check it out if you want. Now, I'm going to show the four Team of the Season packs that I did end up getting. So, hopefully you guys enjoy this video today. Let's, get a, let's go ahead and uh, show you guys the highlights. Bruno Fernandes, Bernardo Silva distributing intelligently. Well, he made that interception. He's got to score! A truly magnificent... Bernardo Silva... Laurent Blanc, Jota. Well, they want that equaliser, but they're passing. It's got to be! And he's got around, looking to carve out a chance. Laurent Blanc. And Renato Sanchez with it now. Provesma! And it's gone in! Blanc has it. Blanc, Diogo Jota. A real opening now. Oh, he's found the net. And that is... By the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but the fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. Diogo Jota. Blanc. Bruno Fernandes has it. In position to give them the lead, maybe. Donato Sanchez. It's with Bernardo Silva. And Bernardo Silva has it. Here's Renato Sanchez. Jota. Sanchez. Blanc. Chance for Bernardo Silva. Well, it might still work out for them. And the ball is in the net. Teammate. Renato Sanchez. Blanc. It's got to be. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. And the penalty is converted. I don't think any... The hosts have really controlled possession. It's important to have strong, dominant players in your midfield, and they've got that. Just look at what that control gives you. It's with Bernardo Silva. 
And Bernardo Silva has it. Shot up. Is it going to be? Well, it's goal after goal after goal. Just no end to this. Two intercepts. He has plenty of support. Bernardo Silva. On to Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes! Well, it's a procession of goals. And surely there's no... And this is Diogo Jota now. Novdi Mukiele. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Bruno Fernandes. And Ronato Sanchez with it now. And the ball is in the net. Tremendous intuition to win it back. He must finish. Reguilon. Far from a good pass. Well, he's lost the ball. From Diogo Jota. It's with Bernardo Silva. Not a fantastic piece of... It might be! The net is staring him in the face! He's given the ball away unnecessarily. And this is Diogo Jota now. Here's Renato Sanchez. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. And Blanc has it. Bruno Fernandes. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Can they convert? Well, it's goal after goal after goal. Martin Tyler, the action is a division rivals match. Absolutely looking forward to this one. Yeah, a real buzz around this ground. Full house. A lot of interest in it. Hope it doesn't disappoint. Guided through. And he's opened the scoring with a fine finish here early on. Caresma. Bernardo Silva. Caresma. Well, he scored to stretch their lead. Back in possession now. Well, here they are, still probing away. Now, here is a chance for them. Oh, great chance. It's another one for them. They go further in front, and they are full value for this position. I have to say, it's so one-sided. Bruno Fernandes, Laurent Blanc. Certainly playing well enough to get their noses in front here. Needs to stay cool now. Well, he's knocked it in. And they've got the lead now. It hasn't come in. Mukiel. And he gives it back to him. Varesma. A real chance here. Push back out into play. It's in. Fine moment for them. Crafting the through pass. Varesma. Bernardo Silva. Saved by the keeper. He can't hang on to the ball. Closing him down. Well, they've lost the ball and gone and got it back high up the pitch. What a good interception. Bernardo Silva. And it's a goal here. Patrick. Goal number three here. And it's a perfect day for the player. Poor shot, to be honest with you. They've regained possession. with Luis Alberto Not pretty typical of Dybala to give it away like that and do they mean business on this occasion are they going to forge ahead Bernardo Silva on target oh, and has oh, scored Laurent Blanc Paresma he's in control of the situation wonderful block Bernardo Sanchez oh it's in a two goal cushion now and the lead fully merited. It's going their way. 2-0. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Can he finish this? Well, that's a procession of goals. Below their usual standards. They're just allowing their opponents too much time on the ball. They have to press more. Can he put it away? And that completes an impressive...
giving the ball away. Rendell, Bernardo Silva. Will he find the net? It really is such a free score. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and see who we got from our Team of the Season packs. Uh, they didn't release anything today, so I guess this would be the good content for today. I would have done this yesterday, but as you guys know, I'm not a huge fan of playing this game. Uh, but today, you know, there was, nothing, there was nothing else. I was like, you know what? Why not? So, ladies and gentlemen, we have four of these 90-plus Team of the Season packs to open. So let's go ahead and see what we can get from each one. To be honest with you guys, I've... If they are untradeable, I wish they were all Portuguese. That'd be great. Or even FC Porto players or Liga Noche players, for that matter. So the first one is going to be a Dutch player, center back, for Ajax. Oh, it's going to be daily blend for that one. So that's SPC fodder for me, just in case in the future. It holds no sentimental value towards myself. So we move. We move. Next one is... Go oh, I have to turn off the... Uh, Game audio, or else uh, audio is going to be a little bit... It could have a chance of getting a copyright, you know? You know the vibes. Uh, Zaza Zahavi, I think that's, that's his name, right? Zahavi. Another SBC fodder for myself. Yep. I. What do I feel like Zahavi's played in the League of Noge? But I, uh, I don't know of him, so no value for me. Next one's going to be... Let's see here. What's it going to be? What's it going to be? French? Center mid? Oh, it's going to be Awar. You know what? It's not a bad pull, to be fair. Not a bad pull. Uh, center mid for Awar. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. Not too shabby. And then last but not least, we are going to go ahead and pack... Do, 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 do. It's going to be, it's going to be, it's going to be... Croatian? Oh, Kovacic? Yeah, Kovacic. Chelsea, Kovacic, Real Madrid. Inter Milan. Okay, so yeah, those are my polls, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Hopefully I see you guys some other time for another one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.